Yeah. I don't know where he, where he thinks about it. See where a deer's eating it? Or a rabbit or something? I probably can't eat them. Because he had white dead. Oh, yeah. Maybe. He, maybe. Good luck. <laughs> it has dirt on it. That's all right. A little dirt, a little dirt won't hurt you. Every day they're in this plot. Every day. Gone. Like just gone. So I start putting those in on them and it doesn't they don't move. Saturday was the opening day of the Pennsylvania season, but the boys and I actually headed up to the Ohio lease to meet Jared and do some prep work. We got some blinds out, got some cameras out, put some corn in front of the cameras, and really it was just figuring and burning some time till Harlan was able to uh, get into the stand that afternoon for the Pennsylvania bow season. It's 75 degrees. Yeah, look at him. Look at his guilt. Look at his guilt. Yeah, it sure doesn't look like he did. <laughs> came close but not close enough and kind of a hard lesson learned as a dad there that um, even though Harlan's really experienced with the crossbow and practice all summer you know sometimes a, a young kid like that can get worked up and nervous and he obviously thought that he could shoot behind both legs and that's kind of what happened and you know just a flesh wound on that buck I'm sure we'll see him again but I'm you know, kind of heartbreaking uh, for Harlan who I thought was going to be able to tag his first buck in Pennsylvania uh, that evening. 